Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh my dear students. In our class today we are going to learn about classifying or sorting. We are going to learn how to sort things into groups. Are you ready? Let us start. So what is our learning objective and success criteria for today's class? At the end of the class, you should be able to define the word classifying. You should know how to say the meaning of classifying and you should be able to put things into groups. So what is the meaning of classifying or sorting? Classifying means to put things that are similar in one group or to put things that are different in different groups. There are so many things around us. Some of these things are living things like the butterfly and some are non-living things. So today we are going to learn how to classify living things and non-living things in a table. Now name the things that you can see in front of you. A man, water bottle, backpack, elephant, van and a tree. We are going to classify them in this table living things and non-living things in different groups. Let us start. This is a man, human. He do the seven life processes. So he is very good. He is a living thing. Very good. Look at the second one. A water bottle it doesn't do the seven life processes so it is non-living thing what is the third object a backpack it doesn't do the seven life processes so it is non-living thing what about the Elephant! Where is the elephant? Yes, here is the elephant. Okay, the elephant, it does the seven life processes. So it is a living thing. Very good. What about the van? It's not eating or breathing. Very good. Non-living thing. And the last one is the tree. The tree breathe, move excrete reproduce yes so it is a living thing well done now it's your turn name the things that you can see now then classify them in a table of living things and non-living things hope you understand thank you assalamu alaikum warahmatullah